What is going on ladies and gentlemen, Monkey Flop here and welcome back to Game on Monkey Flop. Today I wanted to talk about the Nintendo Switch Lite announcement and why fans are so upset and so outraged about the announcement. Now, keep in mind, the fans that are upset are hardcore gamers, the casual gamers that will play a couple of games a month probably won't be upset about it and probably be very excited for it. Um, but uh, let's go ahead and get into the pros and cons. Now, I did feel that Nintendo actually covered a lot of what the Nintendo Switch Lite is going to be like and they covered the pros and cons, but I wanted to give you guys my opinions as well. Let's go ahead and talk about the original Nintendo Switch because I have one of them right here. Um, I have two in total and I, I love the Nintendo Switch because it is portable but at the same time I can still plug in and play on my TV. That's one of the features that's not going to be available on the Nintendo Switch Lite. Another feature that's not going to be available is you won't be able to remove the Joy-Cons at all. On the Nintendo Switch Lite, they are actually um, just embedded into the system. They don't have rumble. They don't have, uh, you know, the move functionality of it. So if you have games that um, need the Joy-Con, then you will have to have extra Joy-Cons um, to be able to play them. So you can still play two player um, or four player with the Nintendo Switch Lite, um, but unfortunately you will have to carry the Joy-Cons with you because the Joy-Cons that come with the Nintendo Switch Lite um, are not removable at all. Uh, one thing that I do love about the Nintendo Switch, the original one, is I can plug this into my TV and play um, any game that I want and be able to record for you guys. With the Nintendo Switch Lite, it's basically like a DS. It's a handheld device. You cannot plug it into your TV. You cannot play it that way. Now, one of the pros is that it's smaller than this big bulky thing. It's lighter. They have new Joy-Con um, buttons here and a different layout it's got more of a d-pad layout right here for you and the the buttons are a lot more uh, conveniently placed as opposed to this big bulky thing right here um, another thing is the battery life on this kind of sucks um, you can get up to three hours of playing it unless you're playing like uh, breath of the wild or something like that but if you're playing um, something a little bit more casual like mario kart you might be able to get like three hours out of this uh, so battery packs are a must if you're taking this on the go with the nintendo switch Lite, we don't know exactly once it's in the consumer's hands how much time you'll be able to get out of playing it but they said it has an extended and better uh, better battery life than the original Original Nintendo Switch. Other than that, um, everything pretty much remains the same. Um, what they are targeting is, um, you know, the more casual gamers, the gamers that like handheld devices. And it's kind of funny because, you know, so many other uh, corporations, so, so many other CEOs, so many other big executives say that pretty much handhelds are done. They're dead. Nobody wants them anymore. But yet Sony um, is kind of blind to the fact that Nintendo has been, you know, having such a success with the Nintendo DS. If you look at the Nintendo DS, um, they have, you know, made so many different iterations and so many different products out of the original Nintendo DS and continued to have success with handhelds even up until this day. A lot of people said that there's not gonna be any more handhelds and the only option is gonna be the Nintendo Switch, which is a great, you know, great thing to have but if you want something a little bit more portable currently in the market, there really isn't anything. Sure, there's the PlayStation Vita. Those are not in production anymore. So you have to buy either a brand new one um, from a place that's still selling it or a used one off the internet and games are going to be a, a little bit hard to come by memory cards are insanely expensive even to this day so playstation vita i love it i still have my playstation vita i have a 64 gigabyte on it i'm good i'm gravy um, but there's no new games getting released on it, which kind of sucks and PlayStation Plus support has kind of ended on it um, So with PlayStation Plus uh, Support I was still getting new games to be able to play um, You know, I'm not really the mobile type of guy um, when I'm playing games I'm usually at home and when I'm out and about I'm usually out and about doing other things um, It is nice to bring a handheld sometimes because you never know if you get stuck in a, a crazy line having to wait for a long time or if you just have some downtime and you need time to kill uh, handheld is a great option but let's be honest uh, 
this big bulky thing it does fit in my pocket because I'm a big guy but it, it's not the you know the ideal thing to carry around it is it's it's huge um, compared to a cell phone or compared to like anything else um, this is my iPhone um, 8 plus and if you guys can see there's a big difference in size when it comes to um, my phone and this big huge thing so um i am excited to see what nintendo brings to us next um as for me i'm not getting the nintendo switch Lite. um there's no need for me to have it because i like the fact that i can plug in my nintendo switch to my tv and be able to play it that way and um not all the games support handheld only um you'll have to check the back of the box to see if um it supports handhelds if you have to actually plug in and play um that's gonna suck because you won't be able to play those games but anyways i'd love to know you guys the thoughts and opinions about the nintendo switch and the nintendo switch Lite announcement in those comments down below thank you guys so much for watching make sure to hit a like and if you guys are new please subscribe with those bell notifications turned on and i will see you guys in the next news update you guys are freaking awesome